I'm Jennifer Eames. I'm a professor in the Department of Physician Assistant Studies, and I was previously the founding director for that program. I've been at HSU since 2015. I was very motivated to start the PA program. It was a dream and very exciting activity to gather all the people together over the years, uh, build the program, remodel the building, uh, recruit the students, and then now to see all the success that's been going forward and to see it in its next iteration under the new leadership. So some of my most exciting things that I've enjoyed being a part of at HSU include some of our mission trips with students abroad. That was so fulfilling and it was just amazing to see Christ's love spread out around the world and to be able to share medical healing and hope to so many people. Additionally, I was very fulfilled when I was able to be the faculty president and be a change maker for the institution and an influence and a leader amongst my peers. It was a huge honor. Supporting students for me really means getting the best out of them to really deliver them an excellent education. It's more than an experience. It's a, it's a really high calling to be a medical professional. So it's important to me that every graduate from our program is outstanding and able to give the best level of healthcare to their future patients. One way I connect with students is to continue to mentor them in advocacy roles. So one of the exciting things we do in the PA program every year is take students to the Capitol. And so connecting with them on a higher level, letting them be engaged in professional issues, making them see themselves as the future advocate for their own profession, and modeling that advocacy has been critical to our success and to getting the students involved and engaged. I've often been quoted saying, he split the seas so I could walk right through him. And that's a line from a song, but it talks about God parting the Red Seas for, the, for Moses and when they were fleeing Egypt. And I feel like the creation of the PA program over the years was the same for me, that everything God put into place helped to contribute to the success, and we could not have been successful without his leadership. So daily reflecting on that and with gratefulness and thankfulness and then also just being sure we incorporate um, Christ's love and all we do and the actions because ultimately he is the great physician and the healing is a miracle. And so we're able to incorporate that and then give our students those talents that they can then go on and share with others. Since coming to HSU, I have been so blessed over the past eight years. I have had my family grow, I have a new grandchild, and that is a huge blessing from God. And my daughter was able to come to HSU while I was on the faculty here and get her degree. So she is now an alumni. And then I've seen so much growth in my career from influence and advocacy throughout many different stages and excited for the next phase. I definitely say that uh, the relationships built here, there's some outstanding people on this campus. I mean, some truly gems and working with them was such an honor. And I genuinely appreciate the fact that they selected me for this award in the past. It made it so much sweeter to know that these are people who are paragons in their own profession and who really, I was able to gain some of their respect and admiration along the way and friendship. So uh, the relationships that you build are the things you carry with you. The most joyful thing about my job is when students have a light bulb moment. That's a really exciting time to see them just get it and something clicks for the first time. It's also really exciting, the same thing with patient care. When you're able to make a difference and really implement a change that can give someone better health, it's, it's an amazing feeling. An important thing I learned is to always be true to your values and to know your why and to know where you stand, and that helped me grow as a person while I was at HSU. And through that growth, I was able to really see things that are important for the future. 